Uvic Game presents 11 Facts About Minecraft That A True Fan Should Know Since its release, this game has become an indisputable masterpiece and legend of the gaming industry. Always maintaining its relevance, Minecraft remains a favorite game for hundreds of millions of gamers around the world, and has become more popular than ever thanks to the pandemic. And although it seems that nothing will surprise the experienced Minecraft players, there are some facts that people may not know about this wonderful game. Juvic Games invites you to test your own awareness. The game known around the world as Minecraft was originally called Cave Game, then Minecraft, Order of the Stone. Many different versions of Minecraft have been released since its release. The original, created by the Mojang team, was created using Java. However, the version most people are used to is called Bedrock. Over time, new versions were created that were used for a specific reason, whether it was for different consoles or an educational model for schools. Minecraft is incredibly popular, so it's only fair that the game would get a lot of different spin-offs. One of the most famous of them was the game Telltale's Minecraft Story. The most recent example is Minecraft Dungeons, a unique to Dungeon Crawl, RPG in which cooperation with four players is possible. The other two spin-offs are Minecraft Earth and Minecraft Classic. Earth is a game in augmented reality, like Pokemon Geo. It allows players to interact with the world and create Minecraft-style structures and objects that can be saved and modified by other players. The game implements the collection of resources and many other features of the original in the conditions of augmented reality. Minecraft Classic is a browser-based remake of the 2009 Classic, released to celebrate Minecraft's 10th anniversary. Classic recreates the game exactly as it was in 2009. When it comes to video game development, the vast majority of developers tend to keep it a complete secret. This allows you to intrigue fans and show only fragments of specially prepared content, such as trailers or concept art. However, one of the interesting facts about Minecraft was that the development was open from the beginning. In an article from Gamma Sutra in 2011, Marcus Persson said, I've been very open about Minecraft development from the beginning. I've talked about it on forums, primarily TIG Source, and told people what I'm doing now, what I'm developing, where I'm at the stage and how I would like to see the game in the final result. In the same post, Notch revealed that he believed Minecraft's success was based on sheer luck. He claimed, unless you're making a sequel to a game, it's virtually impossible to imagine how great it will be, especially if you don't have years of experience like most publishers do. Marcus was guided by his own sense of what should be in his game and what could be of interest to a wide audience of players. He was really lucky in this, we can say that with confidence. One of the most unusual facts about the original Minecraft is its very short development time. It is known that it was hastily made in just six days. However, despite this, the game was considered completely finished only two years later. And after that, Numerous updates were released that completely completed the game and allowed it to become what it is today known, and loved by hundreds of millions of fans around the world. While Minecraft is known for its seemingly endless worlds, it's not actually limitless. This makes sense, since the game does have well-known block height and depth limits. However, Person stated in his blog that the game has limits on the size of the world as a whole, but they are not hard. He explains that the further the player progresses in the game world, the more bugs will start to appear. That is, it can be assumed that the maximum size of the world is adjusted in such a way that it is still playable. Indeed, the world has a border, which in turn consists of several layers to block players from passing through it. When the player passes the first two layers, the game crashes. Sometimes the best things are made by mistake. Creepers are a perfect example of this, as one of the game's most famous symbols was created by a bug in the game's code. First, Notch tried to create a model for a pig, but something went wrong. Creepers were a mistake, he says. I didn't have any modeling software, so to make the models I just wrote them in code. Somehow I accidentally made the pigs tall instead of long. It turned out to be an inexplicably tall thing with four little legs. Then it became a creeper. 
A funny fact about sound design is that sometimes different sounds are created from literally whatever is at hand. For example, when you hear the rattle of armor, there is a good chance that to get it, the developers, for example, hit a bunch of keys on a metal plate. The most famous example of this in Minecraft is Gust Sound Effects, the sound of which was based on the sounds of the game's music producer Daniel C. for 18 Rosenfeld's cat. The sound was recorded by accident, when the cat woke up and stretched making a strange sound, which in turn became the prototype of the famous sound from the game. Like many legendary video games, Minecraft didn't appear out of nowhere. After all, the best always emerges under the influence of something that was invented earlier. In particular, Minecraft was inspired by many PC video games that helped shape the game into what it is today. She was inspired by such games as Dungeon Keeper and Rollercoaster Tycoon. However, perhaps the most notable example is the Infinimina, whose influence person himself noted as having a certain charm that the team was looking for. Infinimina is a mining game with a similar geometric block building gameplay. Perhaps it was she who became the foundation for the future success of Minecraft. This is a fun easter egg that can be seen if a player has logged into the game more than 10,000 times. When this is done, the game name in the menu will appear as if an error occurred. For example, instead of Minecraft, the inscription, Minceraft, can be displayed. Despite the fact that this does not always happen, but such funny elements really show the passion with which the original developers approached their creation. And if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like the video. And Uvic Games was with you. See you again.